Hey everybody, Soybean Farmer. I'm over here in the Allen field this afternoon. Uh, just got home from work. It's about 20 minutes to 7. I noticed this little spot right here um, two days ago. Been on my mind ever since. And that's water hemp that's popped up through here. I see if the camera will focus on it and you can see it sticking up right there across the top of that. It's a small patch of it, but uh, I'm on a seed reduction program this year. And there's a few right there. So I'm thinking 20, 30 minutes, I could probably have this pulled out of here. Um, <clears throat> so that's the game plan is to get over there and pull it out. Uh, this, this year's just been phenomenal. Still really, really pleased with the change up to uh, the different herbicide program. I mean, that's that little patch right there and those one, two, three, four, five sticking up right there. One right over there. That's it. The rest of this feels clean. Now, I can't turn the camera to the west to show you because the sun's, you know, coming down on the horizon and it will really mess it up royal, but we'll give it a shot and see what you get. Back off the zoom. Start swinging around, and as soon as I see that sun ray in the screen, I'll stop because it's about worthless when you, there it is right there. roots on it but I've run into a heartbreak getting out there in that field and really seeing what's going on I got a serious morning glory in 
infestation out there. Now, it was not like that, uh, I guess, was this August 24th? I think the last time I really looked in this field was uh, uh, 1st of August, last of July, and that was, it was clean, it looked really good. This is some more of that stuff that just, you know, germinates with hot weather and all the rain that we've been having. And I hate to talk about that with uh, somebody I think a whole lot of suffering a drought situation. 